Hi guys, I am having so much fun with the HDWM that I'm gonna make another video about theming. We've just seen Dracula and I wonder, um, there's one more I would like to test. I'm perfectly happy with the one we're having now. This is Dracula, right? So Ctrl T. This is the purplish kind of look, purple, purple, Dracula uh, color scheme. Google that and you'll find the website. Getting rid of all your settings is simple. It's a scale, right? Copy paste, everything is, is gone. <laughs> there are some permission denied. Normal, right? It's root. It's all about being able to write. But CHDWM is an application. It's, it's a desktop, it's, but it's an application. <laughs> it's mm, something different. It's like DWM, it's like Dusk. But um, what I'm gonna do is the following is super x restart i want to apply the default settings but <laughs> hey everything is still the same again this is not your default desktop yes we're still on Dracula. So, and that maybe is puzzling, you need to build it. You have to say, okay, now we're gonna open a terminal and we're gonna make this desktop. We're gonna build this desktop. So you make install. That's gonna be installing it. It's gonna go to user, local, bin. And that's the thing you need. Super X reload. I always do a reboot to be really sure nothing messes with my setup right start clean and then we see oh something did change right conkey is back there super c by conkey and we here we have all these things now i do see this should have have some coloring right so what i'll check out is that if the scale thing went well right scale ah there are the colors okay cool it just takes a while so scale is your backup if anything is wrong you can always go in here and say that's the code Control c and then go to this one right Control v and replace all now we're really sure that everything is there not that there were any differences as we see everything looks the way it's supposed to look okay so another thing check out these two guys these two guys should be the same and they are now what we need to build is not this one but that one and now we go for the coloring right so themes let's see dracula grafusha north this is the one i would like to see how is north looking at all now north is another coloring scheme so the developer what does he do he goes to the internet and he says this is a dracula theme north color scheme and we have the north theme so out of the 16 million colors, they've decided to take this and this and this and that of coloring. And then we apply it to our system. Where's the coloring? Here. Those are all colors. If you put this in a browser, you get the color. Okay. So if I want north that's one place to change it second place to change it is the bar let's go like this to the bar so we go to the scripts to the bar and in here is one dark so you have to say let's see if it exists ah yeah, it exists then we can call it safe now normally you say okay super shift r and voila everything is applied no this is a dwm thing this is a dusk thing this is a chdwm thing it means you go here you go here open a terminal 
tell them to make it did you see delete config h did you see that when you make it it's gonna add this so it's this guy that rules but as i said i have the reflex to do this compare and make sure that both are the same so i have a backup right and then sudo make install and super shift r this is the other look well like i said i think it's okay but i'm gonna reboot to be really sure right and this is not just chaddlm it's a reflex of the 33 desktops that i reboot it's eight seconds more of my life and i'm really sure right but no i don't think anything anything changed i don't think it was necessary to do that at this point in time border is indeed this blue it's not purple anymore it's not my light blue default from dark it's um all kind of softer colors that's typical for the the the, the um, north theme right and um it's not a bright dracula was really bright green here and this is softer softer all kind of softer for the eyes so there you go another um video how to do things on chdwm and last time we did we changed the bar at the top to the bottom so that was up here top bar we changed that to zero so went down and we could this is actually the default i'm going to show you the default of chdwm no borders save then it makes sense to build it again so bar from top to bottom and no borders open terminal make and sudo what did i forget eric you did it again right it's a reflex you need to do it if you forget to do it right this is the compare this is always good to do this exercise i do this exercise to avoid mistakes right i say what did i change oh yeah i changed this to that okay so repeating in my mind okay we're without borders now and the top bar is going there did not make any typos is it second control <laughs> that's uh, yeah don't want to waste time with typos and that's why i do this install super shift r awesome it's at the bottom here but where are my borders well they're not there so you don't really know what's active unless you go and move over another window and then you do super q so the color is no longer a hint which uh, one is active because it might be mistakenly do a super q on the wrong uh, window but it's a choice and it's your choice you can put uh, the boards to zero and this is how it would look then and that's the default look by the way all right bye